aortic stenosis produces a high velocity jet of blood across the aortic wall. This high velocity jet can be imaged well only by continuous wave Doppler imaging as it will be well above the aliasing velocity for pulse Doppler. Aliasing velocity is the maximum velocity which can be imaged by a given Doppler frequency and is dependent on the pulse repetition frequency. The highest velocity that can be detected is known as the Nyquist limit. Nyquist limit is equal to half the pulse repetition frequency. The small figure above shows the line of the CW Doppler cursor passing through the arctic wall. The lower portion shows the tongue shaped Doppler signal due to systolic flow in the iota just beyond the arctic wall.